Hey guys, it's me, Jello Pineda, your middle class sneakerhead. Welcome back to another episode of the vlog. Today's video, we are doing a comparison video between two sneakers that, uh, well, this one is a recent pickup and this one is one of my favorites, the Blazer Mid 77 and the Blazer Low 77. So we are going to be comparing these two sneakers. Of course, I know off the bat, these are just the same sneakers, just in a different form. One is in, in the mid top and one is in the low top. But of course, I have spotted out some few things that uh, I think will be worth mentioning in this video, especially if you are pretty much into the details of the sneaker overall. So yeah, if that's interesting for you, keep watching and uh, stay tuned. Thanks so much for checking on this video today guys and I do hope you guys are having a wonderful day. If you're new here, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel for more videos just like this. And if you've been here for a while now, thank you so much for your support. I really, really appreciate you guys. And I do hope that you have been enjoying the content that I'm posting out in the past couple of days. Well, sort of a couple of months, but yeah, basically we're just trying to make some content uh, for you guys just so that you would be more educated enough when you are buying a certain sneaker. So in this case, we are looking at uh, two sneakers. Again, these are the vintage uh, blazers. Uh, Nike blazer vintage 77 in a mid top and in the low top form. Off the bat, you can see that they are actually just the same sneaker. I would be like pointing out some major differences of the sneaker. Basically, they both come in orange boxes. Identical boxes, of course, but however, the sizing would be different because this one came from the mid-top version. It's much bigger than the low-top versions, as you can see over there. By the way, the uh, the low-tops, uh, I was able to grab a 10 and a half. With the high or with the mid-top versions, I was able to grab a size 11. Off the bat, guys, you would see that they are just basically the same sneaker. Um, same elements and so on. Same materials that were used all over. First point that I would want to mention here would be the uh, Nike logo on the back of the sneaker. All right, so as you can see here on the low top, the low top only, the font is pretty much different as you can see there. On the low tops, you can see here just a black Nike, uh, the skinnier uh, font over there and it's not, it's solid black. Unlike the high top versions where you can see it, it's, it says Nike and as you can see there, it does have speckled print yeah, so that's uh, that's the speckled print right there, and it's more um, the font is more bold uh, than this one. Although I would just have to mention that they, they could have done the same thing to the low version because you know that's what we actually enjoyed here on the mid top versions. That speckled print right there is like saying it's a retro version of the original uh, Blazer Mid Seventy Seven. So yeah, so th again, that's worth mentioning. As you can see, it's pretty different. Hey guys, we're interrupting this video for a very, very, very special announcement. I have been waiting so long to do this giveaway and I do think na ito ang pinaka right timing natin para gawin na to. So what we are doing is we're giving out 5,000 pesos worth of gift certificate for you to buy any sneaker sa AP exclusive ang ating Instagram selling page. So pwede kang bumili ng isang sneaker, pwede kang bumili ng dalawa sneaker, basta anything, 5,000 pesos will be on the house. That is gonna be for free. Kung mas mahal sa 5,000 pesos yung binibili mo sneaker, that's fine. All you have to do is pay for the difference and for the shipping. Ngayon, total, meron naman ibang sneakers dyan na medyo mura lang. Sa AP exclusive, pwede kang bumili ng dalawang sneaker or tatlong sneaker, basta magkakasya lahat sa 5,000 pesos. So again, any sneaker that you see listed available on AP exclusive, kasama lahat yan. At meron tayong 5 simple steps kung paano makakasali sa ating ongoing giveaway. Number 1, subscribe to my main channel, The Jello Pineda Channel. Number 2, subscribe to my new YouTube channel. This is Jello Pineda Vlogs. Number 3, follow me on Instagram is at Jello Pineda underscore 03. Number 4, like my Facebook page which is linked on the description. And then number 5, like and comment on this Instagram post with the words done and tag three friends. The winner will be drawn once na nagkaroon na ng 1,000 subscribers ang Jello Pineda Vlogs na channel. So yun ang ating mga mechanics. I do hope magustuhan ninyo ang ating munting giveaway na to. Let's not waste more of your time. Good luck and back to the video. Okay, so number two would be the swoosh. Alright, so the swoosh right there. Alright, let me just point it out here. Alright, so the swoosh. The swoosh is actually pretty different as well, alright? So as you can see here, the swoosh on the low top version is actually fatter than 
uh, the mid top versions. The mid top versions actually has a sleeker swoosh to it, and at the same time, of course, it all meets here in the heel part of the sneaker. While this one does not actually meet, um, it just stops over there. It just stops on the heel counter of the sneaker. So I I'm not sure if you can see the difference, but some will say uh, these are just like small nitpicks, but for some, uh, the bigger swoosh actually adds more um, vibe to the sneaker. It actually adds more character to the sneaker in my opinion. So yeah, that's a good plus for the low top versions, but for this one, it's a sleeker, um, sleeker sneaker. And now in terms of the material use on the sneaker, they pretty much feel the same, sort of that Durabuck sort of material, but um, holding it in hand, uh, the one on the mid-top versions are darker than the ones in the, the low top. It's just a small nitpick. Now I'm checking on the tongue right here. Pretty accurate. Same color, same tags. Everything is uh, perfect. Everything is uh, the same. Even the laces are pretty much the same on uh, on both sneakers. Even the leather used. Now in terms of the actual midsole of the sneaker, uh, they are actually sort of different. but the same uh I, I i'm not sure how i can point this one out this one's more grainy than this one uh but again um just a small nitpick they are pretty much the same and of course lastly would be the uh, insole so the insole for the mid top versions comes in black i mean the swoosh yeah this the swoosh comes in black while the low top versions comes in orange what I actually didn't like about the uh, Blazer Low or I mean the mid top versions is it's really hard to get your foot inside because of the sock liner being leather and all so it's pretty hard to put your foot in but once it's there it stays I guess. Like the uh, simple aesthetic of this sneaker right here when you do it unlaced like that um, although for this one this one I guess would work unlaced as well but in reality um, this one really looks good tidy. I think it's, it's better to keep this one clean. And again, there are different fits that you can uh, pull off in uh, in these two sneakers right here. Well, in the future, when I clean my studio, clean the apartment, I'll probably have like a space for like a whole body uh, video. But for now, I just don't have the uh, the real estate to do that. But overall, man, the, the Blazer Mid 77, either the low tops or the mid top versions are a must cop, especially if you are looking for like your plain sneakers that you will never go wrong with. It's like your everyday casual sneaker so those are the only uh, differences that you can uh, that I can actually spot with these two sneakers right here and uh, let me know in the comment section down below of what you think of these sneakers which one would be your bet is it gonna be the mid top versions or are you good with the low top versions and as well as how would you actually rock these sneakers let me know let me know in the comment section so yeah that pretty much wraps up our short video for today guys and I do hope that you enjoyed this video and if you did please go ahead and smash that like button here on the bottom of the screen it helps out with the algorithm it helps out the channel grow and reach new people and at the same time if you're new here consider subscribing to my YouTube channel for more videos just like this so so there you have it. Thank you so much for checking on this video today, guys, and I will see you on the next one. Peace, guys.